I'm Sherry Kay, award-winning pianist, composer, and national cooking contest finalist. I'm also known as the Jazzy Gourmet, because when I'm at home, I like to jazz up my meals, and now you can too. Hi, I'm Sherry Kay, Jazzy Gourmet, and today I'm continuing my series called Cooking with One Arm and a Sling. And today we're going to be making crescent roll paninis. I know usually paninis are made with bread that has already been baked, but I like to use crescent roll dough instead. And I don't have a fancy panini maker, I just have my trusty George Foreman grill over here, so we're going to see how this works. We're starting with a Cuban panini. Now traditional Cuban paninis are made with ham, pork, Swiss cheese, mustard, and pickles. And mine's going to kind of follow that, but mm, of course with a little bit of a jazzy gourmet twist. Let's start with that mustard. I've got some crescent roll dough laying out here on my cutting board. And I'm going to squirt some mustard there on the bottom. On top of that, I'll stack some ham. couple slices of roast pork. Now you can get all this in the deli. On top of that, some cheese. A couple slices of pickle. And here is another jazzy gourmet twist. I know, I know, unheard of, but apple butter. Yes, there's a lot of sourness going on with the mustard and the pickles, and I think that this adds just a little bit of fruity sweetness to the sandwich. Okay, once I get the apple butter on there, I'm going to take the top square of my crescent roll and place it on top of the bottom square rectangle. I guess I should say these aren't really squares. Rectangle, and I'm going to pinch the sides together. So that it's nice and crimped and solid with all those wonderful fillings inside. Now my crease came apart on the top, so I'll squoosh that together a little bit. Okay. And now it's time to stick it in my George Foreman grill. I've already preheated this, so I'll just take my sandwich, lay it on the grill. Careful not to get your sling on the grill if you're wearing a sling. And press that down. All right, that looks good. Let's see how our Cuban's doing, shall we? Oh, beautiful. Crispy, crispy, crispy. Let's swap our plate out here. And slide that panini down into our serving plate. That looks really, really good. I love it because it has that nice crispy edge to it. And on the inside is nice and creamy. Look at that. Let's give it a try. Mmm. The combination of those meats, the pork, and the mustard, and the applesauce, great combination. Mmm. And pickles, too. Mmm. I'm Jazzy Gourmet. And I'm here to say, why be ordinary when it's so easy to be jazzy? Mm -hmm.